Hey guys, it's me, Sydney. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys just clicked on this video because you guys are incoming college students or you guys are like moving into a dorm or anything like that, hey, my name's Sydney. I'm an ASU student, so I go to Arizona State University. I'm currently a freshman. This is my second semester living in the dorms. I live at the downtown dorms called Taylor Place. So if you guys are specifically like trying to go to Taylor Place or you guys want to see what a dorm room looks like, you guys can kind of see the background of mine right now then you guys can like go into my channel i'll have a playlist for all my asu videos um and then like a lot of them are just like college in general i have my first day of college vlog i have so many things though so if you guys are interested in more college videos um you guys can fully watch this or not watch this i have it linked down below and with that being said though let's get into this video okay so first things first i watched a ton of these videos when i was going into college i literally had everything packed and ready to go like in my head like a year before i even got to the dorms but like when i actually was gonna move in i packed everything a week before so i'm gonna tell you guys the essentials that i think are needs and necessities that you should buy things that you should put on your list right now so get out either a pen and paper or get your phone out you know write it write it somewhere um i hope this helps you guys out but these are the essentials for me and that i've noticed a lot of people that are in the dorms and like my friend katie she's sitting on my bed um i asked her what she thought hers were so like this is like a collaboration list to help you guys out so we're gonna pull up my notes on my handy dandy computer i have right here and we're gonna get into this so first things first if you are planning on you know doing laundry which you should because things get gross First thing you want to do is have extra pairs of underwear so like don't come to college with seven pairs because this is your house You're basically going to be living here for a whole year. You need to have enough stuff um, So like depending on where you live You're gonna want other clothing and I'll get into that in a second but a necessity is to have extra underwear and extra socks because you can rewear a t-shirt and you can rewear a pair of jeans, but you cannot rewear your underwear. So if you're not going to be doing laundry every week, you need to have like extra stuff. I know some people who go like three weeks here without doing laundry, but like they live in the same clothing, but they don't live in the same underwear. So make sure that you have extra underwear and socks because sometimes you lose them. Sometimes you, you know, have your period, things happen and you just need to have extra pairs. Of both of those things the other thing is depending on the climate so like you usually start in its summer and it's kind of like you don't need a jacket um one thing i would really suggest is have a hoodie because like if you're sharing a room with someone or like you don't can't control the temperature of the entire dorm you're gonna want a hoodie like for me in the summer i had my ac cranked but like even though we were both freezing our asses off i literally <laughs> still at the AC cranked and I would just wear hoodies um so bring a hoodie no matter what even if you live in like this is Arizona like we don't use hoodies even in the winter half the time but like right now I'm so hot and I'm wearing this and it's a cropped hoodie but with that being said though make sure you have like a hoodie or something that's going to keep you warm um and then pack according to the climate that you're going to be at and don't overpack because people don't care what you wear in college like as long as you're happy with what you wear you're probably gonna be like me where you're living in your PJs you're living in your workout clothing like whatever you're gonna be more comfortable than you're gonna be like grade A ready to go to look nice bring a couple outfits to look nice too but with that being said that's most of my like spiel about like clothing so then the next thing is to get a mirror especially if you're a girl if you're a guy and you're watching this then like maybe you don't need a mirror but like a full-length mirror is a must I have mine right here that was from Ikea and that was literally like $15 or something maybe 40 but I don't think it was 40 I know they have one that's 40 there but I got that one that was pretty cheap and then I also Target has the ones that go over the back of your door I have one for my bathroom so the next thing is towels and this goes with like shower equipment make sure you bring all the stuff that you want to shower with and don't cheap yourself out on these things because I, one of the things I did in the beginning was I was like I don't need this I don't need that I don't need that but like I use it at home. Bring anything that you use at home because you're not gonna wanna bring, like you're not living here for a weekend, you're living here for a whole year. So pack what you actually need, actually want, and like if that includes bringing three towels rather than one, bring the three. I personally have two towels, they're both from Ikea. If you guys are looking for great towels, ikea bath sheets not the bath towel they're called bath sheets they're so much bigger i'm 5'9 and it covers me from like past my knee for sure probably like halfway to my half of my calf all the way from my shoulders down so it's really nice because like it covers a lot more of your body 
and you can dry off quicker and you're more covered and it's just really nice i have a bathroom in my dorm so like if you have to share one those are perfect too because then you're more covered bring your lady products and bring extra of it so like if i were you i would bring at least three months supply because at the end of the day you're always gonna need tampons and even if you like miss your period a month for a month or something then like you have it for the next one bring the medications that come along with that so like pamperin aspirin um tylenol what else i usually have like naturopathic like cold remedy stuff too because you will get sick here more than you realize i did not think i was gonna get sick as often as i did here um the first like two weeks of living in the dorm everyone gets sick because everyone's like being around one another with germs and like they're not sleeping enough because you're meeting new people and you just get sick so like take the precaution and like really take care of yourself for the first month because I, by the first month I was sick already twice so another thing that is a huge necessity at least for me and this is something that like maybe isn't for you is extension cords because for I feel like for me at least like I have a few I got a lot of mine at Ikea but like you can get them anywhere Ikea Target whatever Ikea though had like a lot of the stuff that I like bought because it had like trash cans and all that stuff so like I got a lot of little things there too but extension cords are a must I actually have one on my bed that like I can have linked down below as well but get one that has USB stuff too because then you don't even have to have the cubes and for me I lose the cubes all the time and like at the end of the day you're gonna want to plug everything in and Ikea has like the six one that's like a square rather than a long one so get some of the long ones that you can hide under your bed that's what I do and then I have it like plugged in behind my bed and then I have some that are plugged into the wall that you know count as six I have one out in behind like I have like a little small common area out there and that one I have like my fridge my blender my microwave all attached to it so like I don't have to use multiple outlets for that so the next thing is cleaning supplies and this is an essential because I d okay so this probably I should have said this with laundry detergent but I didn't think about this so the three well three or four main things that I purchased as cleaning supplies that are super effective here in the dorms is glass cleaner because I have mirrors and your mirror that you have by your sink water splashes up on it and it just looks gross and like grungy all-purpose cleaner Clorox wipes and then toilet bowl cleaner you are going to thank me for the toilet bowl cleaner I did not know how to clean a toilet when I got to college I'm gonna be so real with you because like my mom or you know my little brother he likes to do the toilet cleaning so like I never had to do it myself I got to college and I had to clean a toilet and my toilet looked so nasty because neither the girl that I was living with originally or I really knew how to clean a toilet so we like did it but it looked our toilet was nasty for a while so definitely clean your toilet and get toilet bowl cleaner because I didn't think about that until my toilet was like real nasty here and then the other thing is trash bags so they usually rooms come with like trash bins like for the room to share they're a must they're easier to like haul your trash out anyway rather than taking the container out and then the last essential is non-perishable snacks peanut butter this one tastes heavenly i live off of peanut butter when i'm studying um also not that monster isn't perishable but like I usually have like some type of drinks, either LaCroix, Monster, um, sometimes I'll have soda in my room for other people, I keep water, but like think of things that you like snack wise that are not perishable because then you can keep it for emergencies and like if you have meal swipe card like I do, you use that as much as possible but then if you're in your room or it's really late, everything's closed, then you have those things for yourself. Like mac and cheese is a good option, you guys can watch my videos for other non-perishable like healthy items. But peanut butter is a big go-to. I literally just got back to my dorm. I've been here for maybe a week, not even. How long have we been here? Are you serious? Yeah. How long have we been here? Four days. Okay, well, we've been here four days, guys. And I already finished my first thing of peanut butter. <laughs> this, though, is by Legendary Foods. It's so good. No sugar added, no cane juice, no agave, no honey, gluten-free. It tastes like heaven because it has chocolate chips in it and it's really good you guys it has very few ingredients in this one with that being said another thing that you've probably seen in like every college essential that i was like i don't need command strips oh my gosh you need command strips command hooks whatever they're called i watched so many college essential videos when i was going to college and i never bought command hooks or strips 
until I like moved in and I realized oh my god <laughs> I need them so I you guys can't tell but like right above here all around my room if you guys look at my dorm tour you'll see um and I have these right here I have lights all over and you cannot like make holes in your walls you can't like tape doesn't hold lights up you can't really staple things in you can't use a lot of push pins so command strips are like a go-to so personally for me i don't like the big white command strips but or hooks or whatever you want to call them but they have clear ones that are perfect for your lights if you guys are looking to like put your lights anywhere um you can look at my dorm tour the lights on that i have are hooked in by those the clear small command strips and you can't see them they look really nice and like you can use the small clear ones for other things too um and then with that being said those are all of my college essentials if you guys have any and you guys are in college and you watch this video and you're like hey i have an idea for you comment it down below let's you know start some comments in the description box get everyone talking if you guys are in college where do you guys go you know i'm curious let me know in the comments down below i love you guys so much i hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to like comment and subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video bye babes